LA Police Chief Charlie Beck is promising to speed up the investigation into the officer involved shooting of an immigrant in the Westlake District. Eyewitness News reporter Robert Olguin tells us some community members are asking the DA to get involved. About 20 community activists and a handful of residents today demanded that murder charges be brought against the LAPD officer who shot and killed a Guatemalan day laborer. We want justice and we're not going to we're not going to let this guy off the hook. The Southern California Immigration Coalition delivered a letter to the district attorney's downtown office asking that LAPD officer Frank Hernandez be prosecuted for shooting 37-year-old Manuel Jimenez. That's not going to happen. I mean, we will present a uh, completed investigation the district attorney and he'll make his decision at that point. Police say Jimenez was armed with a knife when he was confronted by officers in the Westlake District. Back on September 5th, they say he had threatened to stab a pregnant woman and that he refused officers' orders to drop the knife. There was no knife in the hands of Manuel Jimenez when he was shot in the head by Officer Frank Hernandez. LAPD Chief Charlie Beck has promised a thorough and transparent investigation. If anybody thinks that I won't prosecute a uh, corrupt police officer, then they haven't paid attention to my history. There was supposed to be a community meeting here tomorrow night at First Unitarian Church to discuss the shooting, but members of the community say that the church abruptly canceled the meeting, saying they'd been pressured by the LAPD. But the LAPD says they contacted the church only because they had security concerns. Reporting from Wesley, Robert Olguin, ABC 7. Eyewitness News.